Dravé syndrome is an early onset epilepsy. It comes on and presents in the first year of life. And typically children present with long, often febrile, often one-sided seizures in the first year of life, otherwise appearing to be completely normal in between times. And then subsequently in the second year of life develop other types of seizures, not with fever, but also in convulsive seizures, myoclonic jerks, um, focal onset seizures. The other thing is that the fact that from the second year of life then they appear to developmentally slow down. They don't make the neurodevelopmental progress they should, so their progress relative to their peers is very slow and their IQ appears to drop. What is different to other types of early onset epilepsy is the um, prolonged nature of the seizures early on, the triggers with illness, and the acquired problems that you get with this. Not least the acquired neurodevelopmental problems, but also later on movement problems, perhaps eating problems. The fact is that the seizures are traditionally very resistant to treatment. Um, and although we know what medicines are more likely to work and reduce seizure frequency, and in fact, perhaps more information about what we shouldn't use because that may aggravate seizures. Overall, it is unusual to have prolonged periods of seizure freedom.